Well, cease and desist. The El Paso County Health Department says it is issuing that exact order to a Calhan restaurant, which began allowing customers into its dining room yesterday in direct violation of the governor's health order, which still only allows restaurants to do takeout and delivery. Carity on News Channel 13 investigative reporter Chelsea Brentzel spoke with the restaurant owners this afternoon. Chelsea? KRDO was actually the first to notify the owners of the cease and desist order against them. But at this time, the owners say they have not been contacted by health officials and health officials have not come out here. Karen Starr tells KRDO she is continuing her fight against the government. Starr says her restaurant will remain open despite a governor's order and cease and desist order to shut down her dining room amid the COVID-19 pandemic. We're told people as far as Aurora have traveled to grab a bite to eat in support of her opening her restaurant on Wednesday. The owners say they are seating customers six feet apart. She tells us her defiance is less about money and more about defending her constitutional rights, which is why she is looking into hiring a lawyer and will take her case to the Supreme Court if necessary. What do you plan to do? I guess accept it. I mean, I'm not going to close. She says she will go to jail if it comes to that, telling us that her employees can run her restaurant if she is arrested. The governor's office said today the restaurant is breaking the law and is endangering the lives of their staff, customers and community. It's important to note that this is the strictest enforcement level El Paso County has taken against a business that we know of during the pandemic for violating a health order. But it's still unclear what officials intend to do if the owner continues to not comply with the order. Live in Calhan, Chelsea Brentzel, KRDO News Channel 13.